Hey guys, it's me, Blue Dog Go. <clears throat> Just trying to remember my intro here. And welcome back to Minecraft Storm Mode. Today we're starting episode 4. Now, I accidentally already started it. So we're not going to see the intro. But we're going to see everything else. Oh, whoops, I didn't realize that was a quick time attack. I was looking down for a second. And convenient horses are convenient. Bingo! As well as conveniently wearing saddles. Everybody get on! Take Gabriel. I'll take Gabriel. Then I've got Petra. Hold on, this might be a bumpy ride. Don't look back. Yeah, I think I have to avoid the mobs. This is, the worst ride of my life. This is fire jockey. That just turned into a I didn't say it was going to be a bumpy ride. I thought I messed up. Are you kidding me? <clears throat> hey, 
so I, it needs to be like fast. Is that what this is called? Okay, perfect. Oh. Bridge. Oh no! Jesse, look out! Kenderman! They're slowing it down! Am I seeing Enderman attack the weather storm? Enderman move blocks! It's what they do! Guys, come on! We gotta build a new one. Do it. So, what are you doing? Yeehaw! Woo! Oh, Axel, you're screaming in my ear. Sorry. some pretty weird stuff back on that horse. She was inside the wither. She might have wither sickness. I don't know. You never acted the way she's been acting. I'll go talk to her. Oh, she's got a me. She doesn't know anyone. Hey, how are you feeling? I don't really feel like myself. I still can't believe you're even alive. Do you not recognize us? I'm Axel. This is Olivia. The Witherstorm did something to her. So, she doesn't remember anything? Not even me? Who can forget me? Jesse, this is awful. I mean, you're not wrong, Axel. No one can forget you. You, Jesse, you're the one who rescued me. Tell me, please, what is going on? All I remember was endless blackness. Up until a little while ago, we all thought that you were, you know. I thought I was too. All I know is, I was so scared in there. I thought for sure I was dying. Well, you didn't. You made it back alive. We didn't all make it back, though. Oh, man. Magnus. For a second there, I almost forgot. Are we talking about Magnus? Yeah. Oh, Magnus. Couldn't believe it, Ben. Still can't believe it. How? How could this have happened? To lose not just a friend, but a member of the Order of the Stone! He knew the risks, and still he let me take his armor. He was so brave. He was also incredibly stupid, but still, so brave. Indeed. <clears throat> Ma! Being emotional is getting us nowhere! What I want to know is, what happened out there today? Why is that thing still alive? My instructions Yeah, you tell me. You tell me. Excuse me? Well, you're the one who thought we could destroy the command block with a big old bomb. So the command block is still out there? Of course it is. Oh, great. And now, to make matters worse, we've gone from one wither storm to three. Our plan was a total failure. I should have cast the foul thing into the abyss. Why didn't I destroy that cursed block ages ago? So is the command block controlling all three wither storms? Oh, uh, why are you asking me? Am I expected to know every last thing in the universe? Well, no. you are sorry. I need a moment to think. Is he always like this? You have no idea. That 
jacket. It looks familiar. Lucas always wears that jacket. No. I saw other people wearing it when I was being thrown from that that monster. Ugh. Even thinking about it hurts. Hey, hey, it's okay. That means Lucas's Jesse, friends are still alive. If what Petra said is true. I mean, do you think? I thought for sure they were gone, but Lucas, your friends could still be out there. I know. And that means I I gotta go after them. They might need me, Jesse. Uh, uh, the room. Everything's spinning. It's okay. Easy does it. So we need to talk to Lucas and... Gravel? No. Dirt? No. Don't I would so. let him. Lucas, what are you doing? But what we need I to do you. is... I'm going after my friends. I thought the other ocelots were dead. We need to keep Lucas. If they're not, I need to go find them. So him. he can get armor. I am grateful to you guys for bringing me this far. You can't just up and leave, Lucas. You're part of our team. And you saying that just reminds me that I left my team. <clears throat> Lucas, look... You and me, we've made a pretty good team so far. I'd even call us friends. So I hope you understand why I need to go help my old friends. They do it for me. But we are helping them. Saving the world saves them too. Isn't that just... kind of abstract? No. The number one thing you can do for them is to make sure we defeat those wither storms. I... I guess you got a point. Okay. I'll stay. I just... I just really hope they're all right. Thanks. I'm gonna go check on the horses. Easy. See if he was searching for anything in his chest. Some leftover cobblestone might come in handy. Don't know why it will come in handy, but it's literally just one piece of cobblestone. How is that gonna come in handy? Take down the storm, don't worry. Ruben. Hey, buddy. You doing okay? Of course you are. Wish I could say the same for everyone else. Petra, how are you doing? Are you remembering things yet? I... I don't know. These little flashes keep coming back to me, but then they float away again. We've been trying to talk to her, but... It's like she's never met us before. I know I've met you. They never really play up on this idea. Or today. I, mean, I, just I guess it's because Gabriel exactly. also can be affected I by keep this. Seeing a dark alley. We jumped off a bridge together. It was terrifying. Slash awesome. Slash terrifying. Are you the one who 
wanted to jump instead of fight? Hey, nothing wrong with knowing your own limitations. Yes, it's working. You're remembering Jesse. Do you remember me, too? No. And yet, I feel like I know all of you somehow. Maybe it's the way you're dressed. Something's ringing a bell. Of course you know us. We're the Dead Enders. The Dead Enders? Wait, didn't we all fight that wither thing together? Yes, we totally did. She remembers it. I remember her running to a, a, a temple in the woods, and we were going to be safe there. And how did I end up inside that thing? Um, uh, well, something bad happened there. I just got up until I chose Gabriel. save you. Things were happening so fast, and it, that would be rude. Thing was powerful. Well, thank you for trying. Um, uh, sure. All that matters is you're with us now, and that you're still a fighter. The best one I know. So, what do you say? Will you be part of our group again? <clears throat> All right. Count me in. You scared Ruben off. Am I glad you came along? Just don't tell Ruben I said that. He might get jealous. How are the horses looking? Tired, but they're okay. Same as the rest of us. Well, I'm glad you're staying with us, Lucas. Yeah, me too. Don't worry, it's for the best. Make it out of this together. Don't run off on me like that, okay? <laughs> Patrick didn't mean it, Ruben. She's just not herself right now. Yeah, I know. I wish she would get better, too. needs us, Reuben. So much of it has already been reduced to bedrock, and it's up to us to save the rest of it. Well, maybe that is a lot of pressure for just a person and a pig, but we have to find a way. We can do it, Reuben. Oh, there's Ivor, and, and there's Soren. Saw it tearing apart the wither store higher. gaze passed over them, and they went wild. If I hadn't seen it with my own eyes... So, I'll give you this, Ivor. You have provided the basis for an incredible experiment. Enough Endermen working together might destroy a wither storm entirely. It's a promising concept, at least in theory. 
Could you coordinate the Endermen somehow? Make them attack all at once? If I know my Endermen, all we'd need to do is get them into the storm's vicinity. In fact, there's probably more than enough of them still in my fortress. An unintended side effect of you flooding the end. This is just like the old days, Soren. You and your crazy ideas... Hush, Ivor, for once! Ugh. Question is, how to bring the Storms and the Endermen together? Endermen aren't pets. They don't follow orders. At least, not for mere mortals. We know for a fact the Witherstorm will follow the Amulet, so if we take the Amulet back to your fortress where the Endermen are... Yes! Yes, that's it! We'll lead them straight into a massive trap! If we can't bring the Endermen... He keeps on saying the them, and I forget that we bring there the is three Witherstorms. Just one problem. You're forgetting about the command block. Ugh. Yes. It's clear now that no weapon can destroy it. Not even a formidable. Actually, I may have a solution to that. You see, when I first took possession of the command block... You mean, stole it? Yes, well, I created a failsafe. A backup plan, just in case. What kind of failsafe exactly? An enchanting book. One that contains the power of the command block itself. Use it to enchant a weapon, and you'll be able to smash the command block to bits. Forever! Yes. Yes, that's it! It could very well solve all our problems. What are we waiting for? Let's go get that book! Just one problem. It's at my secret lab, which is sort of far away. How far could it possibly be? Let's just say it's the farthest place a person could travel before being utterly... Oh dear, what was that? Maybe it could be... The Wither Storm. How did it find us so quickly? We're not safe anywhere, are we? Well, we can't stand around and wait for it. Guys, I have a plan. We're going to Ivor's secret laboratory to try to craft a... Ivor? Oh, I'll be. It is you. A pleasure, as always, Eligard. Anyway, Ivor's figured out the Witherstorms are drawn to the amulet, so we're gonna lure them back to Soren's fortress and destroy the command block with an enchanted super weapon. You figured all that out just now? The point is, we need to get moving. We aren't safe. Not as long as we have that amulet. I'll take it. You can't. I can, and I have to. Are you sure? Axel, are you sure? Of course not. But you'll have three wither storms chasing you wherever you go. Yeah, if things get too intense, I'll duck into the nether or something. I'm tired of always being the selfish one. You just go make that super weapon. I'll meet you back at Soren's fortress. Jesse, it feels like where I belong. Me too. But what do we do about Gabriel? The rest of you go. I'll take care of Gabriel. Are you certain? Yes, I own that much at least. Besides, I'm not going anywhere with Ivor. My friends are still out there somewhere. And you must do this. We need to go. Guys, we need to go now. Hey, Jesse. I know you said handshakes are for dweebs and all, but how about one for the road? You got it. Oh, well. What? Oh, I was going to do it. Need handshakes anyway. I'll see you at Soren's, all right? Not if I see you first. Hey, give me a second to react. Give me a second to react. <clears throat> Not there. Is it much further? 
Not too much further. Are you sure you said that like 20 days ago? Poor Ruben's trying to fall asleep. We must be there now, right? No. No, we're not even close. Okay, so what is it? We're almost there, or we're not there at all. Let's go find some food. There's some potatoes. another potato. Like they say, two potatoes is better than one. I think they say that. Hey, Jesse, have you found any food? I should probably take what I have back to the group. No, because there's a witch hut over here. I'm just gonna pass up. 
what could be inside of here. A witch's hut. Yeah. We should steer clear of it. Nothing good ever happens when witches are involved. Look, a cake. That's that's enough to feed everyone. It isn't worth it, Jesse. Witches hate trespassers. Besides, there are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? Jesse, we shouldn't be here. Witches are very strong. I I can't pass this up. I need you to watch my back, okay? I'm telling you, this is a bad idea. We need the cake. No, I I pressed up. I'll keep watch. Just be quick about it. I don't have to grab the cake again. So I can get both the potion and the cake. Jesse snagged his cake. Makes the whole wall of insanity thing a lot easier to face. Hmm. I think I like cake. Who doesn't like cake? What about the potatoes? By the sight, isn't it? Stretching skyward in all its glory. Soren, have you been here before? Not here specifically, but I have visited the far lands. Oh, the, order traveled the far subtitles have a typo. comes here only for his most secretive research. Whatever Ivor is hiding in here, it will be extremely well guarded. This way, I suspect. I wish Axel was here. He just makes some joke and we'd all feel better about this. I know what you mean. Would 
appears so. A massive one from the looks of it. If Ivor used the command block to build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. So, maybe we should not just wander into the world's hardest maze without a guide. Fortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or I don't know. We followed Ivor to the far land. We might as well keep going. <sighs> Here we go. Into another dungeon of doom. Where exactly are we going? See exactly where to go. Where are we going? Like, I can't go any further here. I had the game pointed at an angle where I couldn't see that hidden place. That is one of the coolest things I have ever seen. Far lands may be perilous, but they are indisputably fascinating. We should probably keep moving. Guys, looks like this is a... Oh no! Jesse! <laughs> Too many! We can't fight them all! Everyone, back! Guys! Caught in the vines! How's Ruben gonna climb these vines? So I can never remember exactly where to go in this maze. <clears throat> We're gonna find out though. I think I remember where to go. You have to go all the way to the left, sorta.
think here's where we fight some mob. Basically shows we're going the right way. Shoot! You have got to be kidding me. Okay, that's a dead end. Which means I think we have to go this way. Let me go this way. Olivia. Now we're out of arrows as well. We have no weapons. And I think this is the way out. So they sort of trick you into thinking that you need to go to the ship immediately. Huh. What's that? Not the ship, the fortress. That's where we're going to end this episode off, though. So thank you guys so much for watching. I was actually able to make it out of the maze quicker than I thought. I'll see you guys next time.